This is a high pressure fuel pump for my 2016 Mark II S Max, uh, 2 litre diesel. This is off the Duratorque TDCI Euro 6, but I think you, you, they use them on other vehicles such as Galaxy Mark 4, Mondeo Mark 5, the Cougar, um, and some obviously other PSA units, like Peugeot Citroën ones. Um, just wanted to run through the common failures that happen with this pump um, and what obviously happened to me. My situation, I, I was coming home from work, come off a roundabout, went to overtake a car. I, was, I wasn't pushing, I was in about fourth gear. Um, I had it about 70% throttle, I think it was, according to the live data. Then I had a spanner come up on the dashboard and literally as soon as it came on, it was on there for a couple of seconds and bang like there was nothing no power engine had cut out completely and i had to coast to the stop um it was giving me codes for the fuel pressure regulator um because my fuel pressure was had it um sorry I just dropped something um but going through going forward um these are some of the issues that you can get obviously like i said fuel pressure regulator these can be got available separately uh, after market I believe they're not great I don't know I've never tried one but I wouldn't unless you was really stuck the other main problem is this pumping mechanism the springs despite being really really strong springs they do break and it doesn't pump if it does pump it's going to pump very little um, because it's operated by a cam inside that spins which then pushes this to set off the fuel um, when that spring breaks you, you get little or no um, fuel flow that's one way of it breaking anyway fuck it second one you've got the cam inside which is this bit this is the most common fault that happens other than the spring um, this hard chrome in that's on the outside the hard chrome in on the cam because this cam spins at high speed which then touches the pump and it just pushes the pump in and in and in and in and produces the fuel flow that that hard chrome wears out um, and once that hard chrome has gone it starts eating at the softer metal underneath it um, and that, that causes the metal filings that will clog up your injectors. Those injectors are about 150 quid each from Ford, I believe, at last check. Um, so it's not cheap. This pump costs 600 quid. From Ford, it's about £720, I think, when I last checked. But that's including like a 140 quid surcharge. I paid £600 from an independent factor. This was a new, the one I put in was a new pump. Uh, same thing, it was a Delphi pump. Just didn't have forward stamped on it um so yeah so fuel pressure regulator your spring breaking and the cam there losing its chrome in which clogs up your injectors um a rarer one that does happen but it's not as common as the other ones but it's a bit rarer but it does happen and this is what happened in my situation this gear attaches to your exhaust camshaft and spins obviously the cam in the other side That shaft snapped, completely sheared off. On my car, I think this was fitted at 131,000 miles. Um, and I replaced it on about 196,000 miles. So I hope, hope that helps um, give you a bit more insight on why these fuck up. Cheers.